ട്രെഡ്മിൽ എക്സസൈസ് ടെസ്റ്റ് ഈസ് ഓഫൺ ടേക്കൺ ആസ് എ ഫിറ്റ്നസ് ടെസ്റ്റ് ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് റുട്ടീൻ മെഡിക്കൽ ചെക്കപ്പ് ടി എം ടി ഈസ് ഓൾസോ ഡൺ ഫോർ ഇവാലുവേഷൻ ഓഫ് എ കേസ് ഓഫ് സസ്പെക്റ്റഡ് കൊറോണറി ആർട്ടറി ഡിസീസ് ആൻഡ് ആസ് പാർട്ട് ഓഫ് പോസ്റ്റ് മൈ കാർഡൽ ഇൻഫാക്ഷൻ ഇവാലുവേഷൻ ടി എം ടി ഇൻ ചിൽഡ്രൻ ഈസ് ഓഫൺ ഫോർ ദി ഇവാലുവേഷൻ ഓഫ് എത്മിക് ഡിസോർഡേഴ്സ് ബട്ട് ദിസ് ഇസ് നോട്ട് എ ടെസ്റ്റ് മെൻ ഫോർ എവറി വൺ കമ്മിങ് ഫോർ എ ഹെൽത്ത് ചെക്കപ്പ് എ പ്രിലിമിനറി അസസ്മെൻറ്റ് ഓഫ് ദ ഫിറ്റ്നസ് ഓഫ് എൻ ഇൻഡിവിജ്വൽ ടു അണ്ടർഗോ ട്രെഡ്മിൽ ടെസ്റ്റ് ഈസ് ഡിസയറബിൾ This will include a short check on whether the person has any medical conditions which could increase the risk of the test. Moreover, it is difficult for persons with physical disabilities to undergo the test. Anyone who has had a recent episode of chest pain, dizziness or breathlessness needs a full evaluation of cardiac status prior to TMT. This might include an echocardiogram to exclude structural heart disease and for assessment of left ventricular function. If there is no such instance and one has a reasonable effort tolerance in the form of ability to climb two flights of stairs at a stretch during routine activities it is reasonable to undergo a treadmill test without a full cardiac evaluation older persons seeking to start an exercise program for fitness needs to undergo TMT in the hospital prior to initiation of such programs as some of them may have silent coronary artery disease silent ischemia can become manifest in such individuals during unaccustomed exertion this could also precipitate a cardiovascular event like acute myocardial infarction or acute left ventricular failure an initial recording of the ecg is done by the technician before the tmt if an old ecg is available the current one is compared with the old one for any fresh changes If fresh changes are detected the test is deferred and further testing sought initial blood pressure heart rate height and weight are recorded prior to the test if there is an extreme of heart rate or blood pressure again a medical evaluation is sought anyone with a current illness like fever is not taken up for treadmill test those with disabilities of lower limb naturally find it difficult to do a treadmill test upper limb disability though it may cause some discomfort in holding balance during treadmill need not necessitate deferral of the test they need a little more motivation during the test for completion of the test and possibly a longer duration of initial test run for familiarizing treadmill walking the person undergoing treadmill test is advised to report immediately if there is any chest discomfort giddiness breathlessness or any other new symptom The technician and doctor in the treadmill room continuously monitors the heart rate and ECG changes during treadmill test to ensure safety. Any significant change in the ECG, heart rhythm or symptoms mandate immediate termination of the test and further observation. Treadmill room is equipped with all emergency care equipment including a defibrillator and resuscitation tray to deal with any untoward event during TMT. Observation for a short period after the test is also routine to detect any changes in the ECG during recovery period which is not uncommon those developing persistent ECG changes or fresh symptoms may be advised hospital admission and further care thank you for watching this video please subscribe like share and post your valuable comment below this video Kindly press the bell icon after that for getting all updates.